Hi, welcome to this video tutorial on the option fair value calculator and the scenario analysis calculator. Here, we'll help you estimate the fair value of your options and also help you with a scenario analysis for different situations. Note that we've considered three major factors that would impact the value of the options, the price of the underlying, the time to expiry and the volatility. Note that we have excluded dividend from our assumptions. Now let's say you want to calculate the fair value of an option, select the underlying. Let's take Nifty in this example. Enter the current market price of the Nifty. The default value is the previous day closing price. So, so you'll need to change the price uh, for, to uh, account for today's price. Enter the exercise price or the strike price for the option. Then enter your date of transaction. The default date of transaction is today's date. And enter the expiry date for the particular contract. So in the current case that is taken as the last Thursday of the month, that is 24th September. Enter the assumed rate of interest. So in this example, the default rate of interest has been assumed at 10%. Now calculate the implied volatility of this particular contract. Now, the implied volatility is the expected volatility of a stock over the life of the option. So as a, as a thumb rule, if the IV is lower, the option price is likely to be lower and cheaper. And if the IV is higher, the option price will be higher. Let's say you want to check the implied volatility for the Nifty. You can go to the NSC website and check the same. Click on this link. This will open the option chain for the Nifty. Now, you can take the current market price from the screen and enter that in your calculator. Then go to the strike price that you wanted to look for. So let's say you wanted to check the IV of the 7700 call. Go to the 7700 call, check the IV column. As you can see, the IV of the 7700 Nifty call for the current month is 23.5. So take that value, change that to 23.5 and then click on submit. So you'll see the value, fair value of the call as per the Black Scholes model is 144.60. If you see the current price is 144.45. So it means that the option is trading at close to its fair value. Let's look at the output of the fields that now we have submitted. As you can see, for the current Nifty of 7654.7, the value of this option is 144.6. Let's say the Nifty moved further up by another 150 points to 7807. 7, in that case, the value of this call would go to 232.89. And in case the Nifty fell to 7500, the value of this call would drop to about 80.79. This is very important for an intraday option player. This will help them estimate what would be their likely exit price for a change in the price of the underlying. Note that this chart assumes that all other factors such as time, volatility and interest rate will remain the same. Let's look at the next factor. This factor estimates the price of the option as the date approaches expiry. In the case of the current option, as the expiry date approaches, the value of the option would approach towards zero. Very important to understand that as a general rule, the option value falls as the option approaches its expiry. The third factor, which is an important factor, is the impact of the change in volatility. Currently, we have taken into account a volatility of 23.5. Now, let's say the IV or the implied volatility went up from 23.5 to 28.5. In that case, for the same value of the underlying and in the same date, the value of the option would increase to 176.5. And in case the IV went down to 18.5, the value of the option would fall to 112.65. It's very important to understand that IVs are extremely high ahead of any specific event or announcement. And they fall dramatically after the event or announcement. And hence, Option prices do not always react the same way as a stock or a contract does. And that's because of the change in the IV. 
the final chart accounts for the value of change in the value of an option for change in interest rate so let's say if the implied interest rate go, went down from 10% to 8% the value of the option would fall from 144.6 to 141.1 so this helps you understand what would happen to the option prices for in case of different situations and different scenarios this can be of huge value to any intraday option trader or even a positional option trader looking to benefit from time decay or move in the underlying price of a particular option thank you for your time for viewing this short video tutorial on the option fair value calculator